And this is the three quarter inch bulkhead fitting, the washer and lock nut. And this is a garden hose fixture that goes in there and connects to the garden hose. I take this piece of wood, slide it through the hole down there, take the two washers, drop them down. And eventually it'll catch and then you just tighten it up. This tool is called a slip and lock a nut wrench. And I can just barely get down in there. And I wrap both ends of the garden hose adapter with Teflon tape to get a good seal. I picked these up at Home Depot. They're little hose mender kits, female ends. And this is just regular door and window caulk. And I like to put a little dab around here. And it really makes it a nice solid seal. This is the summertime setup where rainwater comes down from the roof, fills the barrels up, then overflows down this pipe, runs about 30 feet away from the house. And during the winter, I'll empty the barrels. This is so the barrel, the water won't freeze, gives me a chance to clean them out. And now the rain water will go straight out and away from the house. So here's the finished rain barrel expansion. I added two barrels for a total of 220 gallons of fresh rain water. I like to use it to water the vegetable garden. And it's also nice to have as an emergency water source. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time.